Okay. Oh, no, Johnny boy, it's me. It's Connie. And this time I'm back for good. I brought you out. I thought you were gone for good. Yeah. Well, see, Kate had a blast from the past. Saw someone she never thought she'd see, and uh, I guess she didn't take it so good. You mean blast from the past? My brain's a little fuzzy with all the painkillers, so if you don't mind, can you run that by me again? You know what? It's not important. It doesn't matter, because I'm out. <laughs> and I'm loud, and I'm proud, and I'm ready to party. Besides, Johnny, you and I have a little... unfinished business. What do you say, Johnny? Are you happy to see me? Back off. Oh, what is it? You got a little performance anxiety? No sex, Connie. Ever. Mm, why? There's a bed right here. It's ready and waiting. And when I heard that you took that bullet for Carly, I got really hot for you. So why don't you shove over and I'll show you just how much. Why don't you tell me what you're really doing here? What's this unfinished business? Is your brain really that fuzzy, Johnny? Or did you forget that I took the rap for you killing Star's daughter and her boyfriend? I don't forget. Oh, good. Good, then we're on the same page. Because, um, you owe me, Johnny. And I'm ready to collect. Wait, Kate's... After here. But if you think you're gonna start shooting your mouth off... You mean telling the truth? That's not a good idea for anybody. Right. But mostly for you, right? Because you'd go to prison, Carly would kick you to the curb. That is if Todd Manning doesn't kill you first. There's more to it than that. I'm sure. But you know what, Johnny? I really don't want to hear your sob story right now, okay? I got problems of my own. I thought he was... B hey! Hey! Don't you want to hear my problems, Johnny? Do I have a choice? No. So Kate wants to marry Sonny next week, right? I mean, you'd think the girl would learn the first time she got shot at the altar that that would leave some sort of impression, but no. She wants to go get married again. So here's the thing. That means I gotta be married to Sonny. And you know how I feel about that? Three words. Not gonna happen. What's your big plan? Are you gonna take off before Kate can walk down the aisle? What, you think I cut and run? Hey, all right, so if you wanna disappear, I've had a lot of experience making people do just that over the years. By tying someone to a concrete block and dropping in them in the harbor? No, thank you. No, I'm out of the business, Connie. And I don't want you to die. I just want you to go away. So you tell me where you want to go. I'll set you up. I'll buy you the plane ticket. I'll get you a bank account till you get on your feet. You name the destination and I'll send you there. What, Rio? Amsterdam? You can probably get a lot of good work in Amsterdam. No, no, you see, I tried that and I didn't get further than the airport. Well, you'd have help this time. Yeah. Don't you get it? Sonny's like a dog with a bone. He would chase me forever. And then what am I supposed to do when he finds me? I can't pretend to be Kate for the rest of my life. Let well, me do a reasonable imitation. Sooner or later, you find out. And you would commit Kate. And then I'd be banished from this world indefinitely. No, thank you. Well, you're right. Doesn't sound good. No, it doesn't. It's not good for you either, Johnny. Because the only reason why I exist is our little secret, you see. So if I go to a shrink and he makes Kate remember that she's innocent, we're both screwed. Fine. You're right. You can't run. You can't pretend to be Kate for the rest of your life. So what does that leave you, Connie? Well, see, that's where you come in. But Trey could be... Okay, so you don't want to marry Sonny. Big freaking deal. What's that got to do with me? Just wait till I tell you it's going to blow your mind. Connie, in case you haven't noticed, I'm recovering from a bullet wound. Yeah. My painkillers are starting to wear off. And believe me when I say you're tough enough to take without pharmaceutical assistance. So why don't you get to your point? Then why don't you shove over and I'll tell you then. <clears throat> That's a boy. <clears throat> Okay, so what? You want a repeat performance? Sonny walks in and finds us in bed together. I'm not going to be that much use to you on life support. Shh. What I've come up with is so much better than before. So, what do you think? No way. It's never going to happen. You're not the reaction I was looking for. Are you out of your mind? Hey, Johnny, it's a mutually beneficial agreement, okay? I stay out of the nut house, you stay out of the big house. Forget it. Don't you be so hasty with me, Johnny. You think of the consequences if you don't play ball with me. 
Let me tell you what happens if you don't go with my little proposal. Oh, what, you suddenly remember you're not the one who shot out Anthony's tires? Bingo. Because one word out of me, Johnny, they will open up a whole new investigation. And then people will start putting two and two together, even the idiots at the PCPD. That is if Todd Manning doesn't get to you first. Todd Manning? Yeah. Oh, man, I cannot wait to see the look on his face when I tell him that you are the one that ran his grandbaby off the road. You know, Johnny, Todd doesn't seem like the kind of man that has much faith in police enforcement. I bet he'd take a gun and shoot himself. Sorry to spoil your little revenge plan, but Todd already knows. Really? Then yeah. how are you still breathing? Turns out I got something just as damning on him. No kidding. Johnny, you're smarter than I thought. Yeah, hey, like days? Yeah. Okay. You know what? I'll just go straight to the cops then. You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go to the grieving mother herself. Mm. You think your star attraction will be so forgiven of you? Face it. You gotta go with me, Johnny. You can kiss your freedom and probably your life goodbye. I can't do what you're asking. That's the point. I'm not asking you. It'll destroy my relationship with Carly. What does that have to do with me? I'm not doing it. And you think Carly's even gonna go for that? You think Sonny's gonna buy the whole thing? Yes, Johnny, because we're gonna convince them together. Okay? Come on, Johnny. We'll make a good team. What, have you forgotten about that already? Give up my proposal, huh? I have a brilliant idea to stop Sonny and Kate's wedding. No, you see, that's our brilliant idea. And Johnny, come on! It could work. And you know what? We might have a lot of fun doing this. It'll be a disaster. Oh, come on now. How about the power of positive thinking? You're gonna have to start doing that because... Either way, Johnny, this is happening.